Hello everybody, welcome to Snyder's Inc. And today we got another King Fossman video. This is the scariest police videos ever captured by officers 2. We don't get right into this, ladies and gentlemen. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, comment, thing down below. Let's go. Hello guys, time to take another look at some scary videos filmed by officers. Now let's buckle up and stay frosty. This video was captured by an officer who is patrolling an office building at night. He and his colleagues have heard and seen many creepy things in the hallways in the past. And whenever there's something mysterious going on, they start documenting it. Tonight was no exception. The man states that he initially heard someone talking and the noises were stemming from the elevator area. to show no fear. That's the best thing to do. Just don't show them fear. Because if you do... Wait, there's... where? Oh! What's that? What the hell? What is that? You see this? What's this thing? What is this moving? Right here. What is this thing? What is that? What? What? What was that? The man finds no huh? trace of whatever was lurking from behind the elevator wall. But if we take another look at it, it becomes evident that a strange looking piece of cloth or black shadow seems to be waving towards the man. That's what's weird, because it doesn't look like a wave. It just looks like it's just trying to smack the wall, like, consistently. But it looks very weird. What the hell was that? He is sure that this was something paranormal. And if nobody was pranking him here, maybe he's right. They were praying and they did a fucking cool, really well good job. The following was captured by an officer on patrol who was called to this newly built residence because someone was suspecting a break-in. However, they found out that the owners were not home at the time and that nobody else had entered the premises. At least I know I'm not crazy. Because there's definitely somebody standing right there. Tell me how that's and now they're back. You see it? I'm gonna need this is one of those cases where Foss may will have to show me what he's looking at. I can't see it from first glance. I need him to show me. Oh. Tell me I'm crazy. That is the creepiest I've ever seen in my life. Absolutely not. 
It's still being speculated as of what was going on here exactly, if this was just a trick of the eye, or if somebody was hiding so well that even the police couldn't find them. Either that, or we were seeing some ghostly activity here. And now let's hear a quick word from our fantastic. Oh, we always keep the sponsor. No, no, no sponsor. No, 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 no. Sponsor wants to promote me that can sponsor me. Staff in an old factory. It all started with him seeing strange shadow silhouettes at night. And at this particular one, he saw these things again, which is when he. So I'm guessing this is a security officer, not a police officer. Start a document. Because police officer wouldn't be. Dogman for seeing shitty shadows because he shouldn't be here that enough to two. Venting it. The alien black manifested herself again. I worked this shift by myself at night. Okay, I showed this thing before. No. So this is supposed to be the woman. Okay, I don't know how you could tell that's a woman. There's nothing about this that says woman to me, or man, or anything. It is uncertain what exactly this black shadow is that our know. guard is seeing here. But he swears that other people can see her too during the day. And that she even moves around ever so often making him believe that this shadow being is bound to the storage facility. But who can say? Closed mall. The following case was unfolding in a food court in the midst of night at the closed mall. One of the officers was apparently picking up the sounds of a crying girl from one of the cameras which was situated about the dining area. Then, as one of the patrolling officers is called over to check, he in fact discovers a little girl. However, the girl seems only visible to him. He asks her what she's doing there, to which she answers that she's looking for her mother. Look, I don't know if this is real, because they could easily fake this. Do you know how e This is probably the easiest one to fake. Right, you just go at him and have him, like, pretend to talk, because we can't pick up the audio, so we don't know if he's actually talking to someone. He's just kind of moving his head and probably talking, and then they'll be like, hey, who are you talking to? And he'll explain he's talking to a little girl and the little girl, and then they'll say there's no one there, and he'll probably freak out and run away. He continues to talk to her for a few moments, and then leaves the area to pass on the report. You can tell that he seems a bit on edge. Especially when his colleagues tell him that nobody was there with him. Very creepy for sure. Okay, so here's what I thought happened. I thought he heard something behind him would come back and then the girl's gone. So because the girl's gone, he would then freak out. But it seemed like, okay, he talked to her, he finished his conversation, then he just for some reason became on edge because I told him no with it. This is so easily fake, it's unbelievable. That's so easily fake, it's unbelievable. I have to, I, I have to go fake. The moving car. The following video was uploaded to the official channel of Policia Nacional de Ecuador. And it stems from a CCTV camera, which was situated in the parking garage of one of their local police stations. So I'm gonna assume this car just starts moving. 
Okay, I'm guessing it's not the car that talked around. It's this one. That's my assumption. It starts with one of their security personnel, parking the car, then locking it and exiting the parking garage to start his shift. However, something strange will happen next. Oh! So he, the guy parks it here, and it drives itself all the way into the wall. But listen! We watched... Okay, me and my friend watched a bunch of fail videos and, yeah, a bunch of fail videos. You'll be shocked how many people forget to put the car in drive, okay? To put the car in park. someone in the car there was someone in this car who's in this car don't tell me you guess there was someone in this car what a very powerful force seems to push the car forward without the keys in the ignition this of course is a very hard th was that not? I swear I thought this was someone. I guess I was seeing things. There's no one in this car. Apparently, I thought this looked like someone in the car. This little area, this thing right here. But I guess it is. I got very annoyed by it. I'm, I'm very annoyed at myself for that. But like, dude, okay, so that isn't you leaving a car not in drive. Because a car not in drive will go. But not that fucking slow. Like, that was slow moving. Thing to do. Many officers are telling stories about eerie encounters they've experienced down there by themselves. That would freak me the F out. That would freak me the F out if I went and I know where I parked my car, and I look, and it's parked some, it's drove forward, and I know it's like turned off now. I'm tripped the fuck out. I would trip the f out. No idea how to. I would have no idea how to think or anything. So, is it possible that something otherworldly was going on here? The following material shows a team of police officers from Brazil who were called to an abandoned school. Oh, I've seen this one. This is the one with the door slams on its own. And this one I can't I can't explain. I can't explain how you fake this. I can't explain anything on this. This I don't know how to explain how they fake this. Apparently, there were some extremely loud noises and neighbors suspected some intruders in there. How do you explain that? How do they think this? Vai, mano, vai, vai, mano. Vai, mano, vai, mano. Vai, vai, mano. It's not a surprise that the squad. You police are absolute cowards. You're in a crash and you run out of the building? Ain't that your job to deal with it? Your job ain't to run from the fucking feet like a bunch of cowards? Like a bunch of biatches? You ain't supposed to ran in fear as they could not explain this strange phenomenon. 
as they had witnessed the door slamming with a considerate amount of force, although nobody was even in this old building except them. Another unsolved case to this day. Was it a ghost? What's it? Oh god. Now to another pretty chilling case that has been recorded by a police officer. He and a colleague were called to a local forest as a hiker heard some extremely scary noises. They thought at first that a wild animal got loose, but after listening to the screams, they weren't so sure anymore. You know what? I know you're police officers. This might be the one time I understand if you don't want to go look for it. Listen, that thing looks. That sounds terrifying, and I wouldn't want to go look for that either. Could this have been the- I have no idea what that is. That, I don't want to know what that is. That can stay in that forest. That can have the forest. I, I ain't going to tell it to move. The infamous Bigfoot, or maybe just a mountain lion, deer, or bear. CCTV capture, yep. The next video was shared by two officers from Argentina who were working security that night. They were checking the different security cameras that were mounted around the premises. Apparently there had been a terrifying incident unfolding the night before and the two officers were hoping that one of the cameras might have captured this incident. At first it appeared that they weren't in luck but eventually came across a really spooky sight. What the hell? Okay. What in the hell? Uh huh. Oh yeah, my lord! Nope. 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 Fuck that. Fuck that. If I see that on the camera, fuck that. But I don't need to. I don't need to live here. I don't need to work here. I don't need to know. Nope. Nope, y'all, do y'all have that? Y'all have that thing? Nope, you can have that. Um, nope, that. That. We can see a person that seems to be smoking something. However, the flames are just so massive and the whole encounter just doesn't feel right. Right? But what's even more is the woman suddenly just disappearing into thin air. Not to be seen again. Now this easily could be faked, I'm not gonna lie. But I just, I, I'm gonna hope that, the, I'm gonna hope that it is, cause again, I ain't fucking with that if I see that on security camera, no thank you. And then, based on many comments, the lingering smoke seems to be forming the shape of a skull. How eerie. I don't know how they It is unclear what exactly had transpired here, but it left the officers extremely unsettled. Okay, that did leave a skull. That was a straight skull. No, that was there, a What exactly had transpired here? But it left the officers e extremely unsettled. That's a skull. 
That is a. St you can see the outline of a scope. Now, nah, fucking hell. Burn it. The next video was a submission and was supposedly filmed by the dash cam of a police cruiser. The officer on patrol. Oh, what? I feel like I know what this one is. Was Ben Malik. Didn't expect to see anything extraordinary that night. However, this should change rather quickly. After driving for a while, the officer notices a strange person in the left side of the road, and it seemed that they had started a fire. Of course, this was more than reason enough to pull over for him. Based on his reports, the woman seemed to have a burning face, which the man could not explain in the slightest. And this is another case for which most people simply don't have an answer for. The man believes. I would need more information before I could have that thing. I don't think anything has ever come from information on this chick. And this thing seems to be that like, oh, she. He ran to. He saw this. He pulled over. She does that, and then no one knows anything afterwards. So it makes it so weird. That the woman was performing a ritual of some sorts, and it is stated that he arrested the mysterious woman shortly after. Who knows what exactly this dashcam had recorded here? Oh, okay. That's the first time I've heard that part where he apparently arrested this woman. Maybe something she was doing deserved to be arrested. Maybe for our own good safety, probably. What do you think was going on? Now a recording from an officer that was patrolling the wing of an older airport, which Mr. supposedly Jerry. was completely abandoned at the time. He wasn't the first person to have seen and heard really odd things going on there, especially the washroom areas were notorious for inexplicable noises. Tonight he documented these weird happenings. Aquí, en este pasillo, hay un baño. En este pasillo hay un baño. Hay un baño de mujeres. En este pasillo hay un baño de mujeres. A esta hora hay un fantasma juguetón que juega con las llaves de lavamanos. Ahí está. Este es el baño, ese es el baño, y como ustedes se pueden dar cuenta, están las luces apagadas. Ay, qué miedo, no hay nadie, no hay nadie, no hay nadie, no hay un alma aquí abajo, no tiene por qué haberla, y en este baño menos. Sin embargo, allí está el fantasma jugando con la llave del agua. Es obviamente una mujer, bueno, a menos que sea. Me voy a acercar poco a poco. I can heal the faucet. Se prenden las luces por mi presencia. Ah. 
jugando con la llave? ¿Ah? Necesito otra prueba. Necesito otra prueba. ¡Ay, marica! It appears that this spirit. I mean me too. Yeah, he was like, give me another side of the door close. He's like, shit, fuck me, I'm out. <laughs> I'm out, brother. Man was gone. My man was gone. It seems to be pretty smart. Even responding to our guard here and proving him wrong. Maybe there is a reason for its presence. Some say it wants to be noticed. Could this be? Whatever the answer, it's pretty eerie for its presence. Some say it wants to be noticed. Could this be? I'm gonna assume this is his shadow. Eh? I'm gonna assume. It wants to be noticed. Could this be? Whatever the answer, it's pretty eerie. This infamous video is known to many as the ghost car, a mysterious... Oh, this one's been somewhat explained on how he could do it. You have the fence line where it's perfect, it's in a certain place. And it has to be broken in a certain way where you could drive under it. It's it's possible that the car just got pure pure lucky. Pure luckiness from this car. The driver who was trying to escape police that night vanished into thin air. This mysterious he doesn't driver tricks cops into thinking into thin air. he's about to pull over, then all hell breaks loose. The officers watching this tape get only a quick glimpse of the man behind the wheel. It's the last look they'll get. For a moment, it appears as if the driver and his car have disappeared into thin air. But in the blink of an eye, the driver comes into view again. This time, he tries to outrun the police rather than just vanish. Okay, first of all, the car never, literally never went out of, did never disappear. Its little headlights are right here. You can see its headlights thin air. the entire time he's driving. But I don't know what the heck you mean. It looks like the car just disappeared. But in the blink of an eye, the driver. The car never disappeared. The car just drove fast, then slowed down, and then drives fast, then goes to a fence that I assume the driver knew was there. Driver comes into view again. This time, he tries to outrun the police rather than just vanish. <laughs> His moves are still baffling to the police as he swerves all over the road, driving like a man possessed. And just when he's really thrown the cops for a loop, he gets back on a straightaway, showing off a seemingly supernatural speed. In just a moment, he's going to make a turn into the twilight zone. Watch. The fence at the end means no way out, or does it? To this day, it's still unexplained how this car could make it through this wire fence. And he just drove under it though. The car never the police car never drives into the fence. It stops at the fence. So we don't I think it was bro it was broken to this then the car drove under it. And the car you can see this in the fence flings back into place before the um police get there, making it look like and a escape the fence. police. I think that's what it is. These cruisers. Some people claim that the car drove through an opening in the fence yeah. that wasn't captured on camera. Yeah. And that this whole thing is not more than just a hoax. However, this theory has never been proven. And while this could definitely be the case, it remains a ghostly mystery. Hold on, it's not a hoax. I bet this was an actual police chase. I don't think they faked the police chase. If it's an actual police chase, it's not a hoax as in it's a freaking, um, that the police, the car thing, the hoax part was the fact that the car just, 
cars that will escape police custody and then they decided to just turn into a ghost car. I don't know why. Driver of that car must fucking be proud of himself. One of the most infamous dash cam videos known to man. The following video was recorded by CCTV and captured by security in an old nightclub as the officer was checking the surveillance after closing hours and when nobody was supposed to be in the building anymore. They noticed that something was quite amiss. Apparently a child might have made their way into the closed club. comments on this. None whatsoever. Because this is shit. Yeah, she looks like it's walking, doesn't it? Now, for the staff, it's without a doubt that this was the statue of a small child and that this probably must have been a visiting spirit. Of course, we also have to be open to other explanations, like the reflection of some cobwebs, for example. But yet, this is certainly a mysterious capture, whatever the exact reason for this. These recordings stem from a young security officer who was working the graveyard shift in a hospital in Chile and he was responsible for keeping the place safe at night during the ongoing renovations. But he states that human intruders weren't the only thing that he was concerned about. He saw and heard some really inexplicable things during his shifts and eventually started recording them. Creo que el sonido vino de por acá, me parece. Hola. Vamos a seguir mejor. Apaga la linterna. Aquí no hay nada. Pinche su madre. No voy a de dónde. Mejor voy a salir luego de acá. Man. Zoom me está fallando, pero ahí sí. Oh, los pasillos de acá. No de ahí al fondo. Como pueden ver, aquí está todo normal. Así que vamos a... Bueno, vamos a seguir explorando por aquí. A ver si es que encontramos alguna cosa interesante. Bro, how did he not see that? Get it, Tai. Oh my God, someone stayed in there. Conchito madre, conchito madre, what?
Trên đất tay Cái đàn đấy There is without a doubt some really creepy shadow sightings that nobody has any explanation for. What do you think is going on here? There's something there. Clearly. On patrol. This point, this is the, last the following point. clip was shared by maintenance tunnels, and it was another recording that was captured by the dash cam of a police cruiser. That night, two colleagues were out on patrol, and they weren't expecting anything out of the ordinary at the time. However, at some oh, I think I know what this one is. point, they saw a black object running across the road. Yeah, everyone tell me that. Boy, look, I live in this county since I was 12 years old. At the farm, Daddy's farm. Yeah. Still got the land, and anybody coming on my property to look for no good, I'm gonna shoot them. Oh, what the? What the? was that? Did you see that? Yes. Holy! What the? What's that? That was on two feet, wasn't it? Yeah. Oh my goodness. I thought I was seeing things actually. Oh my goodness! Please tell me we got that on audio or video. I probably would have almost had to if that thing recording. You say anything down there? Mm -mm. Yes. They parked the car and were giving the area this thing appeared in a good look. But of course, they could not find anything. Why this video is labeled possible Bigfoot sighting is unknown. Many people state that this looks more like a shadow figure crossing yeah. the road. What are you? I think it's just, oh, it's a dark thing and a shadow crosses the road and it looks, it could have been a, they both saw it must be Bigfoot. I don't know why Bigfoot, because that not would have crossed my mind either. Shadow figure. Belief though, is this a paranormal encounter? Coming on my property to look for no good, I'm a shooting. Oh. <laughs> Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, that's it for this reaction video. Let me know what you think in the comments. Hit the like button and subscribe button. Thank y'all for watching. I'll see y'all for the next one.